In other education news, help is on the way to senior high school science labs. As part of the state's first science week, Governor Schaefer has unveiled a new program that will improve the labs throughout the state. These students are doing experiments in genetic engineering. They are working with DNA, the genetic substance that has most recently been in the news in the identification of rape suspects. This very morning, there was an article about how DNA was used to identify a rape um, rapist, a rape suspect. But what makes this lab unusual is that these are high school students who attend Polytechnic Institute. These courses are normally taught on the college level. I feel privileged above other schools having a chance to work with this stuff. It not only teaches you the skill, it teaches you um, how to uh, adapt to certain situations, how to react with other peers. But this lab is the exception and not the rule. It was made possible through an ABLE Foundation grant. This is more of what a typical science lab looks like in many schools. The only thing that distinguishes it from other rooms are long tables and a few microscopes. In fact, in this case, a lab assistant has to physically cart the lab equipment into the classroom. But today, Governor Schaefer announced a new program that could help update high school science.